new at 6, students at the Virginia School for the Deaf and Blind are learning about teamwork and competition. WHSV News 3's Elizabeth Lamb tells us why some students are heading to a National Academic Bowl to show off what they've learned. Virginia School for the Deaf and Blind students Hannah Mills, Sierra Campbell, and Javier Alcazar have studied their way to an academic bowl in Washington, D.C. I've learned so much from this school, and it's kind of a time to show off what I've learned over the years. We want to show that our school is a good school, that we're, we're smart. I always believe that it doesn't really matter who you are. You have to work hard. Hard work leads you to success. The team is trained with practice questions and a team supervisor, Rhonda Jennings, who's also deaf. Being deaf, it's very hard, and you, challenge, you, you face challenges every day. But I want them to know that they can do it. They can make it. Don't sit back and say, oh, I can't do it. I want them to know they can. This is the way the competition works. A question pops up on the screen, and if students know the answer, they hit this flashing buzzer. Then they write down their answers and compete against other teams. The students will compete against other deaf students from around the country. The competition has inspired all three students to go to college and to keep learning. If you don't learn and you don't grow in your education, your success is going to be limited in the future. They've also inspired each other through teamwork and learning together. It gives me more confidence. I know they're beside me all the time. They're there to support. If I'm lost, they'll help me. I feel wonderful about this experience. It's such a blessing. In Stanton, Elizabeth Lamb, WHSV News 3. The academic bowl starts this weekend. Students compete in a regional competition, then move on to the national competition.